a new manager starts working at a company and almost makes the company go bankrupt with his terrible decisions. Our next. It posted from Moose Corky. Just like most companies, my company was forced to go completely remote as a byproduct of the pandemic. Jesus Christ. No wonder Grandpa fucking moved. Goddamn idiot. Oh, shit. That was stupid. But nothing came out. And after a moment, he closed it again in a defeated sort of way. She's an awful woman, said Hermione in a small voice. Awful. You know, I was just saying to Ron when you came in. Huh. We You've got to you do dumb something bitch. about her. I suggested poison, said Ron grimly. No. That's why you I pull mean, in the right way. The dreadful teacher she is. Now we're not going to learn any difference. It's easier to drive you drive the right way. Well, this is small. Well, you've got all that armor. It makes more sense for you to get through first. Perhaps it would, to Miss Right. But that's only if I intended to leave. Chapter 38. Despite all the strange... ...things Eric had borne witness to since leaving Maple Park, that moment in time would always stay with him as one of the more surreal. The sounds of slowly dying flames Back? being fed by oh! murderous paper monsters, serving as the background to a knight, a pig at his side. Staring down a paladin whose stature was closer to the pigs than the knights, neither seeming willing to budge. Those things will swarm us in the open area of the mountain, Timis said. Fireman's lift and carry the Neville leaned against the door frame for a moment and wiped his forehead with the back of his hand. He looked like an old man. Then he set off down the steps again into the darkness to recover more bodies. Harry took one glance back at the entrance of the great hall. People were moving around, trying to comfort each other, drinking. Kneeling beside the dead. After for these two, they were apart and he was miserable for about six months. Another guy kept asking her out, but she wasn't interested. She was obviously still hung up on my friend. One of our mutual friends told her, I swear, the nanosecond you go out with another guy, you're jack. But X will come running back with his tail between his legs. They were wrong. It took two dates before my friend begged her to take him back. They are very happy now, though. I'm... No. He knocked on the door. The door opened, but no one could be seen to open it. Pippin looked into a great hall. It was lit by deep windows and the white aisles at either side, beyond the rows of tall pillars that upheld the roof. Monoliths of black marble, they rose to great capitals carved in many strange figures of beasts and leaves. Far above in shadow, the wide vaulting gleamed with dull gold, inset with flowing traceries of many colors. No hangings, nor storied webs, nor any things of wool.
Ready, somebody gonna hurt your damn car?